The construction of an apartment complex in Bemidji for those experiencing homelessness has begun. The many partners involved in the project held a groundbreaking ceremony today. Mel Meyer reports. <laughs> Representatives from the nearly 20 groups involved in the project attended the ceremony. As the temperature hovered around zero degrees and the ceremony moved indoors nearby, those working on the project noted that not everyone in the community has that option. Today, one of the things I realized about Minnesota is how beautiful it is in the winter, uh, but it's also a very, very treacherous environment in the winter. The apartment would have 40 single room units for chronic alcoholics. There would also be 20 units for those recently homeless. It's salvation for 60 people in Bemidji that are going to have a place to stay. Mayor Rita Albright said the complex would help area businesses. She said that some of the downtown owners have asked the city to address the transient homeless population. And so we tried a few very small things to, to help them out. Um, so we knew that this was something that the downtown would support. Center City Housing Corp said this is the fourth project of a similar nature, but the first in the Beltrami County area. The permanent supportive housing structure would also provide case managers if the residents opt in. They would also be receiving additional medical care. Sanford is providing us a nurse for the building. Uh, Upper Mississippi Mental Health is providing two caseworkers for the building. Uh, so it's been a huge collaborative effort. The partners hope that the building will be opened in fall of 2017. In Bemidji, I'm Al Meyer, Lakeland News. The complex will cost about $7.5 million to build. Company representatives say that there were many different funding sources for the project. Bemidji sold the property to Center City Housing for a small fee, but representatives said that the property will still be paying taxes. If you've enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland Public Television.